A while back, I bought the Wayne's World car, the 1976 AMC Pacer. Schwing! <laughs> How you doing? I gave it to Bob to restore it, and I'm picking it up. I cannot wait to see this car. All right, you ready, Bob? Ready to party, guys? Swing! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Dude, this is sweet. What do you think, son? It's still the ugliest car in the history of the world. <laughs> I know, but... Bob, nothing on you, but it's still the ugliest car that was ever made. You have to appreciate it's the Wayne's World car. This is one of the most iconic movie cars there is. Now, what all did you have to do to this? Almost everything. It was like playing whack-a-mole. Every time we get something fixed, something else would break. So how easy was it to find parts for this thing? Parts are almost impossible to find. Nobody likes these cars. Um, Taillight lenses were $500 for the two of them. Really ridiculous. So is there like a store where you buy the licorice dispenser, or? That was actually the original licorice dispenser from the movie, and they mounted it through the roof, and it was so disgusting because the rain just fell through it and the dirt just laid in the licorice dispenser. After about three soakings in bleach, now I would eat licorice out of it. Most of the stuff we just redid, all new rakes, completely new front end, steering rack, fuel pump, power steering pump, alternator, water pump, gutted the whole interior, and it got rat infested. I took rat's nests out of everywhere in this interior. Cleaned it all up, cleaned the floor, got new carpeting, did all the body work, built new speaker boxes because they were all rotted out. So basically, we're the only people in the entire history of the world to restore a rat infested AMC Pacer. Probably, I don't think there's too many around. <laughs> So how much money do I owe you? 18,600. That's a new car. <laughs> <laughs> you think he's crazy? <laughs> I think you might go in the record books. <laughs> so how much did you spend on the car? Bought the car for 9,500. So we're just shy of $30,000 into a AMC Pacer. Yes. Hey, Corey, I'll tell you, they get 15,000 for clones. I think the movie value is there on this car. So I'm in the car right at $28,000. I have no idea what I can get out of it, but I think I can make a lot of money because it's that iconic of a car. There's at least licorice in that thing, right? Oh, for 18 grand, I threw in the licorice. Swing. <laughs> well, thanks, Bob. I appreciate that much. Anytime. Um, all right, let's get this thing out on the road. I would like to keep the car, but I'd rather keep my wife, so I think I'm gonna have to sell the car. <laughs> but before I need to sell this car, there's one thing I need to do right now, and that's take the Wayne's World car down the Las Vegas Strip. Schwing. <laughs> well, what do you think, guys? Do you feel cool? Not at all. <laughs> Hell yeah, I do. <laughs> All right, you gotta admit you like the car. I love the car. And why does it smell so bad? It doesn't smell bad. It's got that new car smell. I wouldn't call it that, but <laughs> You know what? Even though it's You get recognized in this car, oh. it's a head turner. Oh yeah, it's a head turner. That's not sure. by people that I wanna see. I don't care what Corey says, this car has been a lot of fun to drive, and we've been getting a lot of looks. Whether they're good or not, I don't know. Enjoy the ride, or I'm gonna turn around and drop you off. You can let me out right here. I'll take a cab home. It's cool. What is cool? This car. I'd rather drive around an OJ's Bronco. <laughs>